Oh, hey guys, Mike Lear from Miniature Painting. Can somebody, that's, that's you there, can somebody tell me what this has to do with this? Miniatures. Stay tuned. Yeah, you know, kind of absolutely nothing. That's that's the whole idea. But the result of this could be really interesting. So if you're low on basing material, you need to base something like this, then it would be most awesome if you could have something which is readily available and uh, easy to get by, which you normally throw away. Uh, let's take a look at it, right? Let's go. So here we are, and of course you have the idea, when you drink loads of this, you have loads of these, right? See? More. There's some crap here, there's some more stuff here, but uh, mostly you have a lot of these. So what are you going to do with that? Well, let me show you. So obviously you're going to need a plate, and then you're going to need one of these. And try to get your hands on one of these, that's a knife, and see what happens. So you can cut these open, you can just throw them away of course, but you can also cut these open and look what's inside. Oh, marvelous basing materials, marvelous, marvelous basing materials. And uh, do a lot of these and then when you're done you would have something like this. So now you're stuck with a really a lot of dried up coffee. So what you're going to do now is just take a spoon and press it down. Make something really nice. Make a coffee pie. And with this, you need to go to somewhere where you can dry the stuff. So um, let's go to the, uh, to the oven. Yes, and when you're done with uh, unpacking everything and uh, putting it, uh, what do you call it? Putting it on, on the plate, <laughs> there's no... There's no real name for it. You just put it in there, put it in the oven for about 130 degrees. Yes, I'm European. And um, for about 10, 20 minutes. And then when you're done, it should look exactly the same as we put it in, but it's dry. It's uh, really nice and fragrant, if you like coffee. And um, it's ready to be uh, used as basic material. So let's get to the table, right? Let's get, get out of there. Come on. Do you want me to get angry? Come on, get out. I'm watching you. So as you see, I uh, drink a lot of coffee, but um, I'm not sponsored in any, any way because Wild well, Nespresso is way too big for a small YouTuber like me. So, what you do, smack a bit of glue on there. Well, you know how to base. There you go. Get your crappy old brushes out. And like I said, I'm not really affiliated with uh, Nespresso. <laughs> I just had the box come in and I didn't have a proper working place. So, uh, this is why I'm using it. Check out what I got here. It's a big pot of coffee. I just put it in. Twist it around. No mess, no fuss. This looks really stupid. This is why you watch me, guys. <laughs> a perfectly sandy base. There you go. Ground coffee, used coffee. It will be as hard as rock when you uh, when you let it dry. And you've got instant sand. No, even no need to paint it. Hope you found this useful. If you uh, feel interested in uh, watching more videos, please subscribe, like, share. Do I know what and all the shenanigans you can do with uh, a video? And uh, see you next time with a proper painting video again. May the dice be forever in your favor.